Okay, this is a game that um, my children, my students have always, always, always found to be very fun. And it's the I Have Who Has game. So, um, and I make I Have Who Has games for everything. I make them for fractions. I make them for decimals. I make them for sight words. I make them for color words. I make them for um, addition. It's just a fun way to make sure that children know what you want them to know. And this isn't gonna work because there's too many cards, but I'll give you the idea of how it would work. Well, you would have a group of children sitting around you and each child would have maybe five or six words, depending on how many they can handle. And um, you start with the beginning. So the person who has the star starts us off and they will say, I have the word always. Who has the word gave? And then they would turn this over. And then the person who has the word gave, which I'm looking around, where is gave? Ah, here it is. Would say, I have the word gave. Who has the word these? So then you look around, who has the word these? And if I'm Working with new readers, I have them lay their cards out so that I can help them. I have the word these. Who has the word around? Who has the word around? I have the word around. Who has the word goes? Goes. So everyone's looking. Every single person is looking to see who has goes. And then somebody will finally say, oh, I have it. I have the word goes. Who has the word those? Everyone's looking. I have the word those. Who has the word because? Now everyone's looking for because. Everyone's looking. Everyone's looking. So they're developing their literacy. They're developing their visual acuity. I have the word because. Who has the word green? Green, green, green. Where's green? Here it is. I have the word green. Who has the word upon? Upon. I have the word upon. Who has the word been? Ben. I have the word been. Who has the word its? Its. I have the word its. Who has the word us? Us. Now somebody might say, I have us, but then you say, oh no, no, no. Remember, silent E makes the U say its name. I have the word us. Who has the word before? Before, I have the word before. Who has the word made? Made. I have the word made. Who has the word use? I have the word use. Who has the word best? I have the word best. Who has the word many? I have the word many. Who has the word very? I have the word very. Who has the word both? I have the word both. Who has the word off? I have the word off. Who has the word wash? I have the word wash. Who has the word by? I have the word by. Who has the word or? I have the word or. Who has the word which? I have the word which. We have all the cards. So that's the end card. So here's one set. Here's another set. Here's another set. <laughs> Here's another set. You can tell these are popular, right? Here's another set with little monsters on them. <laughs> and then we also have sight word Uno. More sight words, a little bit. Sight word number cards. And then um, these are more sight words. Um, these are by Dolch or Fry, I can't remember. Let's see. Level two, Dolch. So these are the Dolch words, level two. And if you go by Dolch words, you'll have one set. And if you go by Fry, then you'll have another set. If you're in kindergarten and first grade, then um, you'll want to pay attention to what your school uses. And um, I just found these on Teachers Pay Teachers, and they're so fun. I printed them out. We made them into fun games. And I just keep all my sight word games in this little bin. And we've got 
we've got a bunch and the kids can go to the there they can go here all the time and just play you know this is after they've done their work and they have free time choice time which is pretty much all the time because if they say teacher kelly can i do sight word sorry with my friends i'm not gonna say no <laughs> of course i'm gonna say yes <laughs> so if they're gaining literacy i'm going to say yes all right i hope you liked that